was a dream that was real. It shall be realized. These are the wishes of Marcus Aurelius. Yeah, that, that's the one thing that scares me whenever I see a patch or something. Alright, yeah. Let's say I was I was I was gonna steamroll the Western Empire. And we're at war with the both of the desert faction factions, which is not good. Yeah, let's go, go get rid of this castle over down here. I'm gonna forget it. And it's gonna be a pain in the ass to like go back to it. Okay, well, never mind. We got the bunch of prisoners. Let's drop them off somewhere. took this for myself yeah I did yeah I'm just gonna place the leader over there and sell off the rest and right did I set this up here yes I did we already have a bunch of their lords as prisoner and now we get more <laughs> Oh, oh wait, we're, never mind. We're taking prisoners out. Hmm, this gives me an idea, actually. Let's, like, pick them all up. Leave the lords in there, of course. See how much money are we actually gonna get from all of these when we sell them at the tavern. Oh dear. I'm off with the clicking today, definitely. Any 5k for all of that. That could have been a little bit better. I'll switch this out yet. Because I'm probably gonna go besiege the settlement down there. Hopefully, we're not gonna run into it. Well, we're not gonna run into a position. We're just gonna be. I like, get halfway over there, and then something's gonna get besieged up here. Most likely. Okay, that's all fine. This is fine. Yeah, let's get the what's the what the fuck is it with the poppin? I don't know. Right, can I increase the influence? Go he what? Okay, that's still a bug apparently. know what those do. And let's try to... Yeah, avoid... Oh my god, why is there so many of them? Let's disband the army real quick and form it again. This game is saying that. Yeah, look at that. The, the, the three of my vassals are counted in the defense of it. 
What? Makes sense. Like, there's no way, that, there was no way that they had like 900 people in the castle. No freaking way. The, well, the, we can't complain, right? The game is in early access after all. Let's see if we can grab a piece with the Azores, well, the Scythians. Not really. But we can go to war with the Patanians again. Because that makes sense, doesn't it? Decent amount of money. I think they increase the amount of money you get from the settlements, actually. As you know, we were barely making money in the last playthrough. Okay. No catapults on their side. Okay, there we go. That wasn't long enough. That wasn't that long. Check something. Uh... Okay, now. Wait. What's our... Oh! We can actually place Archer somewhere else. Let's... Throw them out. Don't tell me that fucking bonfire is gonna screw me up. Might. It might. No? Okay, we're good. Yeah, like, spread them out like that. Just leave the infantry right behind them. So if we can just rush in. Let's see what the AI does. Split them up again. Well, that's what I don't like about the siege battles at this moment. You can like do a whole lot of like managing and like placing stuff around and you know. Getting them into some nice positions even when depending on the AI is just gonna say fuck you, we're gonna switch that all all of that around. Yo, we have a clear shot at them nice. Move them a little bit towards here. Move! 
This might end badly for the archers. And the infantry is close enough. Thankfully. Or barely. You can bait the enemy outside. To come out. On the settlement. So that's good. They actually got a this amount of elite troops in there. Yeah, you know, like higher tier ones. And placing the archers in the back like that is kind of actually smart too. <laughs> have a clear shot at that well they have a clear shot but there's a bunch all of them have shields so Yeah, the enemy doesn't place archers like be, be, like behind the wall when uh, the wall isn't breached, right? We don't need any of those. Five kills, not bad. I don't want to fight in the keep. Not will resolve it. Ooh, another large bag of peel. Nice. We can just dump that right then. We don't need it anymore. And let's pick up everything because it doesn't seem like the troops are going to get much experience. Nope, we're not going to take it for ourselves. That's not what I wanted to do. What the? What? Oh. I guess they dumped the prisoners in. Jeez. Screwed by your own, by your own vassals. That's nice. And they don't actually have a garrison in there. That, that may be an issue. If like um, each and every town we conquer is not going to leave uh, troops in there. Well, that's mainly because... Uh, I mean, so... My guys don't leave troops in there. In the city that's not ours. Come on, uh, place some garrison in there. Come on. Just so they can't actually like just walk in. Oh, suck ass though. Actions. Score. I get what all of this mean. Me? 
Yeah, I don't get what it all means. They have some militia, so it's a good move. Unfortunately, we do need to chase these guys out of there. Just having elite troops still. That's always funny to me. These. Okay, this. We need to help this guy because he's going over there to dump some pres uh, d dump some uh, troops in there. Yeah, I think most of our troops are just. Too OP now. I'm sorry, but I can't read that. Okay, hopefully that guy's gonna make it over there. Ooh, look at that. I don't think we can catch up though. skills actually give him tactics oh come on so freaking close that one just have licks lipstick on her is all in the most of these but there's no point in fighting him unfortunately for me I do need to go stop these guys because they're going for the castle over there I wonder if they be able to catch these guys too we're at that point in the game you know what I am gonna fight this one just so we can get some action in here assume they're gonna camp that hill so let's sit here Okay, I need to wash out here 
Guess I can get one shot more or less. Archers are gonna get them off the hill, definitely. What, no more pillow? Okay, those aren't mine. I wish the cab didn't have the like red cape on them, even mine. You can actually tell which ones are which. Well, some of the units like these, the Auxilia Coho, uh, I can't, I can't pronounce that probably. Ooh. That's a decent amount of experience for the troops. Have to save him again. Uh, what? Okay, maybe not. I don't get why these castles are tagged, even more of them now. I got no clue. I need to finish up that mission somehow, some way. Oh, I think he just... Ah, eh, fuck him. He's defending what? Where on castle? Wait a minute. I'm confused. Let's just go take Lagetta. Uh, 
What's worse than uh, a lot of big armies going around? A lot of small ones. And I'm gonna uh, recreate the army just before I siege. Just so we can get that full cohesion. Oh, look at that. I guess let's join them. Hey, what? Besieging? They're gonna... Th what? That army is gonna go all the way up here to besiege that. What the... Oh, God. We're gonna peace out with the Western Empire before we peace out with the Scythians. Uh, that's gonna be freaking nice. I'm gonna hope these guys actually decide to do the smarting and defend this. I think they will, but still. they're coming what oh my god it's... Jesus yeah catch him for me yes nice god the AI stupid sometimes well not sometimes all the time a little bit follow me horsemen soldier arrows on my flag in fact hold arrows and we definitely keep spawning like right next to each other I don't know why that's happening oh this is the defensible one but the AI doesn't know how to defend Properly. Cavalry. Forward. Nope. Well, you can actually destroy shields, apparently. If you're on a horse and, like, have all the perks and a shitload of stats, apparently. I think, I think the infantry is a lot better just because I uh, actually, because you can actually like assign companions to categories uh, or like, you know, make him lead troops as captains to so give them all their stat, stat boosts. Like, uh, what was the point before that? Like, what, you just, that just didn't work, right? I 
Come on, who's still alive? Two guys. Generic Centurio is still alive. What? Oh, there's li there was literally too many of us to get them. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, let's take them all since we're right at settlement. Let's give the troops some loot. Pick that up. Oh my god, I'm not going to be able to dump all these, am I? Oh, why did they change that round? Like, it makes no sense. You can dump however many prisoners you want to in your own cities. So, like, what's, what changes? And will these guys actually make up their minds? Now they're going to defend that. Okay, I'm gonna besiege this then. Oh, never mind. They're. I have no words. I have zero words. This is what happens when the game bugs out. Well, nothing I can do about this except just um, Alt F4. Actually, since I have that recorded, I should probably send it over to Tail Worlds. Maybe they can fix that because that's I think that that's the second time that happened to me. Apparently the last save file was a pretty long ago. Wait a minute. Was there an option for that? Yeah, every like 10 minutes. Okay, now at least we know what's gonna happen, right? You guys are gonna bounce around, doesn't know what to do. Maybe I can try and get this guy pinch him. Never mind. If they're gonna besiege that, let's actually try and besiege. Whatever, however that's pronounced. But do not put that army inside of there. That, that's definitely an ego. No go. If 
basically the, there's so many of them running around that's gonna be a problem actually uh, that city over there had 500 uh, 500 guys in there the garrison I mean we could take that on but uh, take a, a, a little bit of losses the infamous circle formation. <laughs> Alright, I need to not get the horse killed because we're gonna need him. I should have a shot on him. Should make us make them come at us. It would be cool if you can throw this spear there. Because it's the last resort. Yeah, they're coming at us. should hold my shield up just in case what the fuck is the cab doing say I'm gonna try and knock out the cab but I could yeah I can't tell which ones are theirs except from like their shields maybe
Only one loss on our side. Ooh, are these are the amount of experience there. Nice. So we need to go back. We try to save our friend over there. Or, you know, the friendly castle. What is we can move 10% faster while moving to the army okay that's good points required per party to call to your army okay mm -hmm. let's see i think this is gonna be better so if there's like a, a port that has like really low garrison garrison troops so we can just auto resolve it Thing is gonna be better. Ooh. Look at that. Oh wait, never mind. They just <laughs> they just recruit uh, contracted all the mercenaries that exist to fight us. Actually, let let them like go and besiege it. Well, fuck. Yeah, we need we need to piece them out now. I can't tell with what this means. Uh, oh, we're giving them money, apparently. Okay, now... Let's ban these guys real quick. Start moving right. Because can pick up a little bit, like, more troops. these guys lost their companions somehow oh fuck it I'm gonna deal with that later maybe never anymore get some more food though and let's see if this is Yeah, this is turned off. The while 
well, maybe they survived and they're still running around because it turned off the guard recruitment. I got, you know, the AI forming the guard parties. Okay, now let's see. Yeah, we're gonna take this these two real quick and swoop from the south. Would be nice if we got a peace deal with these guys so we don't have to worry about them just you know coming in and taking what we got, what we took for this. Damn it. Let's see if I can actually force a peace with the Ezerai. Mongering bastards. Like, sure, I'm down for war, but uh, not with that many factions. At the same time. Looks like we're gonna piece them out anyway. Because the war exhaustion is. Ooh. many troops to choose from that up. that's about it everything is finished up here Let's go over there and besiege those. Oh, right, we need to call in these guys. I think you get the peace deal automatically, even though the other faction, other clan members, well, not clan members, but clans in the in the faction don't want to peace them out when you get a hundred war exhaustion. It's gonna take him a little bit to come here. We should be able to besiege the castle over there. Just in case. I'd actually get a fight in front of the castle. With a couple more. G oh, yeah, we are. God damn it, our guys are not gonna get, get to us in time. This is going to be a pretty big battle. We can actually catch him. Yes, we can. They're actually attacking me. So for once, I'm on the defensive side. Okay, that's all set up. Oh, perfect. problem here is like figure out which way they can come at us see they can come up that hill Forward! Move! Move! 
Okay, now I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna make another... <laughs> and switch. These, inf these infantry. And a couple percent of them, like 20% of them. Play some... some of them there full arms one hand Bring one hand athletics no tactics still place this guy here Forward. actually add a couple of more in there 30 percent Cav is gonna do let's just place him here maybe I should like spread out my archers too in two formations so they're kind of angled a little bit a little bit better Do we have another guy that's good with bows though 60 60 60 60 this guy Like move well spread out a little bit. So like Forward What I can't like sp spread them out here because there's a what one rock in the way? The fucking sucks ass. now is can the archers actually fire from up here archers cavalry infantry archer hold our fire mm, they can They're this annoying. I'm gonna go take care of them. Yeah, he's dead. My question is, which way are they gonna go? The archers don't really have a quite, quite a good shot on them, so let's move them back. Should get some flanking action up here. It's like, get them to move. Cav is kind of, cavalry is kind of in the way. Let's uh, see if we can 
I don't know, actually, like, move this way. And you know what? Let's uh, F3 toggle transfer all women to one. Yeah, so this is what, uh, what I mean, like, uh, Let me just go through your infantry, uh, yeah, and go for your archers. More or less. Yeah, we should have met. We should have met them in the river. In the river over there, definitely. That would have been. That would have been a little bit better. Oh, oh, I see what the problem is. In this particular map, my infantry is spawning. Uh, I'm just transfer these into the archer core. My troops are spawning in the in front of them. Over there, not here. Yeah, I should. Oh, that's what I mean with the re like spawn points are kind of still messy. I wish they like change that how that works around a little bit. Camera is still pretty freaking high. Should be fine. I think they're actually retreating. Like outright. It definitely seems like it. Even though there's 200 of them left. Yeah, they are. I can still get one shot because a lot of these didn't actually throw their peel them. Look at that. I guess the idea here for the cav is going to be like in the room total war. We basically just need them to mop up the enemy once they start retreating. So there's nothing of them left. At least that's the way we're, we were doing it. Back in the day. We need to kill, what was it, 80 or 90? Like, I think it's 90% of the enemies, so the army just disappears off the face of the earth. 